What's up guys, welcome back to Scrap Mechanic, and uh, if you see the last episode, I literally just got um, everything inside the ship working, got the battery, and got the uh, capability to use the craft bot, which is what we're going to use to make the um, vehicle that we're about to build. And um, yeah, I had a little look around for the garage, but I couldn't find it, so we're going to do it here and then use the buggy to go exploring, obviously. And uh, before I started, I got everything organized inside the ship because uh, my vonit my vonitry <laughs> my venetry was full and you can just place stuff down if you just like have stuff in your action bar you can like stick it wherever you want it and it will stay there um, it won't disappear but obviously you can also stack things on top of each other some things you can't like them oil cans um, you can't stack them they just go you know wherever it'll tell you oh that's the wrong way around that little me Use Q to rotate, and there we go. So yeah, got that all sorted, got all the parts that I've collected. I think I've got everything I need. We might have to go and get a few bits, but we'll uh, see as we go. We can definitely get the engine done. But I know, I f well, I think we need to put the uh, lift down to build it. So we'll just stick this down here somewhere. How does that go up and down then? Oh, you use the arrow key, okay. And if you press H, it'll bring up the um, how-to menu kind of thing. And it will guide you through how to build the first vehicle. So that's really handy. Um, so we've got the lift. So now we need to put some blocks down. And I guess you can do this out of whatever. Uh, I think I'm going to be stingy. And I'm just going to do it out of wood for now. Because um, it's only going to be for getting us around and... Um, yeah, I don't want to waste the metal I've got in case I need it for components. Or well, maybe we can uh, get all the components built first and put it together. Alright, so we need the engine, we need the seat thingy, we need the wheels. We've got some wheels, they're just the scrap ones. Oh, are they bearings, I think, maybe? Okay, I've got two, so I need a few more. Maybe we can make some. Or maybe I have to go and find them, we'll have a look. Right, okay, I'll get the, um, let's get the engine and the, like, seat part made, like the control box, whatever you'd call it. What is it called? It's all right. Oh, just drive the seat. Okay. <laughs> so we need 10 metal, 100 wood, and two circuit boards. And we've got that. God damn, that's actually a lot of wood. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, we might end up with more metal than wood. All right. Let's craft that. Oh, it takes time to craft. Oh, okay. Can you queue stuff? Oh, you can actually make some scrap wheels as well. Okay. Oh, we can make bearings. That's good. Oh, we're going to need that tool as well, the connect connection tool. Buttons, switches, cardboard boxes. I mean, we can make the chassis out of cardboard boxes. <laughs> I won't do that, I won't do that. Um, engine. Yeah, obviously we need that. Let's just get that craft. That's 30 metal, 20 wood, three circuit boards. Okay, you can't queue stuff. Okay, so we need to collect that. Then craft that. Another 35 seconds. Um, I've got two bearings right there. So I need another two of them. I like the fact the craft bot's humming, that's great. And being collect. Right, okay, and we want two of these. Can't make two at a time. Uh, maybe you get like a better craft bot, a gadget. Maybe you can queue stuff out, I don't know. Maybe you can have several craft bots. I would like to be able to queue stuff or have things going simultaneously, for sure. And then we want ten metal and two circuits for the connection tool. Let's get that going. And there we go. At all. Right, okay, so how much? We've got 70 of each wood and metal left. Okay, that should be quite a lot. How big are the blocks, though? Okay, they're not exactly ginormous, are they? You know what, let's just go for it, see what happens. Work with what we got, right? Oh no, they're, they're a certain way around. And I'm getting each block back. I'm not losing anything when I pick stuff up, so that's really cool, actually. I can't see which way round that is. <laughs> oh no. You know what? It is what it is. I can't get it the way I want it. But that's a little detail that only I'm worried about, I'm sure. Alright, okay. So how big is this seat? You know what? I'm going to wait for the morning because I'm not convinced whether this is enough light. And I still have not edited the first video, so I'm not sure how this translates in editing. But uh, we'll wait for morning and um, get the rest done. Oh. 
that's like exactly the same size as what I've just built. Okay, that's cool. Right, it's a bit lighter now, let's uh, see. So I think this actually fit perfectly on there. Hey, snap, god damn it. What? No. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. Not bad at all. Right, let's get that metal back out. Right, now I'm thinking. Well, let me just check. So how do the wheels go? Okay, they go down. They could be anywhere. Uh, I'm thinking, though, what I'll do is we'll go like this. And we'll go... Get, get under there. How do I... Okay, we'll go like that. And do the same this side. So that's going to be where the front wheels will go. And then for the back, I think what we'll do is... Okay, cool. So my thinking is that um, I can't build like a little hold all thing yet to like hold wood in or anything like that. But maybe I'll be able to place it on here. So what I'll do now is just put some oh, side parts on. Oh, I'm out. Okay, I need to get some wood quick. Let's have a little look. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, I've got that block in there. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look great, but looking like it'll be alright. We'll see when it's finished. It might look right when it's finished. I'll just get uh, another bit of wood and we'll carry on. So, uh, a good way to like make sure you can see everything you're collecting before you refine it if you want to do it like me where I was just chopping it up and I'm going to refine it afterwards and also to stop things rolling away because some of it does roll away and uh, my mate showed me this is you can just stand things up like this and uh, obviously not only does it stop rolling away but it's nice and easy to see where it is while you're you know chopping loads of trees down or whatever because sometimes, like, I've hit a couple away from me, and then I can, I'll forget about them. You know, like this one that's miles away from where I was chopping down the tree. Say miles, a few metres. You know what I mean. <laughs> I would have forgot about it. So you can just do this. It just makes it easy to keep track of everything. There we go. Can I refine it when it's standing up? You can. I can. It makes things much easier, actually. Right, that's all them done. Got 161. I'll keep this one how it is for now because I want to use it to see um, if I made the back of the cart big enough. I've just realised I didn't even put the engine in yet, so I'm going to have to move a few things around, but we'll do this first. I mean, that's pretty damn perfect. I'm happy with that. I'm going to have to pick these ones up. And I'm going to pick that up. I want to pick that up and we'll fill that back in with words. And uh, how big's the engine? Put the engine there. Is that going to be the right way around? Does it matter? Um, I don't know. Right. Now, let's make this a bit longer.
Right, okay. <laughs> it's starting to take shape now. I've just been out wondering while it was night trying to find some more metal and I've run out of things to drink. Um, I was just running around, I was just wondering if I find some water, if I fill up the little cup I picked up at the ship, maybe you can drink water? Uh, I'm not too sure, but I'll find some water in a moment. But I thought I'd grab some more metal while it was um, night time, because uh, I didn't want to stand there waiting. I hope this thing ain't kill me. Sweet. Any more? Just a little bit there. Dude's also getting a bit hungry. Better eat something. Ah, tomatoes give you water as well. Okay. Well, that is good to know. Let's eat a carrot. Oh, everything does. Oh, okay. I thought. Okay, well, I don't need to drink water now, that's good. A water? <laughs> Some water. Don't think anything else was around here. Don't know if I can get up there somehow quickly. want to get back to my uh, vehicle before I run out of daytime there, really. Um, the day seems to go really fast, and the night time seems to... Well, it feels like it takes forever. Maybe that's because I'm just waiting for the daytime. I can't get up there in a minute. Don't waste too much time looking. Right. There's the smoke trail, that must be where the ship is. Um, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, I thought I'd go grab some more metal because I wanted to um, change some in. And I wanted to do it with metal. So, and I said earlier, didn't I, I should have checked the thing while we was building. But, I need to put a bearing on the front part to add the steering. And um, also, the wheels go on like a single block. So I don't need two blocks for one thing, but I do like that look. So what I'm going to do is just make this come down lower. Oh, I can lift this up higher, can't I? What an idiot. I keep forgetting that. Get up there. There we go. Perfect. So if I do that and take that one away, it will look a bit weird. Oh, actually, okay, I need to do this first night. Okay, I need a bearing. We need to do that. Then add that. Okay, so let's do that here as well. B. Pow. 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 There we go. And then these back ones are going to need to come down. I can actually save a block there. That's good. They don't need the bearing because I don't, I think the bearing's for the steering, do you know what I mean? So I don't think that'll matter. Why has that done that? That looks weird. What's happened? Ah, oh, well, that's annoying. Okay, I don't know how to fix that, but I don't want to lose my little creation. There we go. Ah, oh, where well, there's a wheel, there's a way. Right. That can go there. Right. Um. Now, I believe we just need the wheels, right? We've got the engine, we've got the seat, we've done the bearings in there. Oh, okay, I need two more bearings because each wheel needs a bearing to sit on. Okay, all right. Two more of these done. All right, that's them made. Now, just remember, I've got a little light. I can put that on the front. And we got a rubber duck. That can be the little mascot on the front. That's a great idea. Why well, didn't I think of that earlier? Right, okay. Let's just put this on while I remember. Oh, shame I ain't got two. Oh, I can't centre it because of the damn size I went with. Well, we'll just have one for now and hope we find one later. Right. Um, so, bearing. So, I think this goes on there like that. Uh, then we need the wheels, which I forgot. Crappy little scrap wheels. But they'll do until we find some proper wheels, you know? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at it. I'm really happy with that. Right. Do I need to connect anything? This never mentioned anything in here. Oh, okay. We do. And it's just a simple connection from the seat to the engine and then from the engine to each wheel by the look of it. Set bearings to the right rotation. 
Wait, 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 wait. That's just confused me a little bit. So it doesn't mention it when you put the bearings on. It just tells you to slap the bearings and the wheels on. Then get your tool out, connect the stuff. Um, then set. Okay. All right, okay. Well, let's do what it's saying. So we go from there. Oh, okay, like that. And then we go from there to the bearings. Max connections reached. Why is it saying that? No, wait a minute. How do I um? Ah, how do I cancel connection? Oh, there we go. You right click and it turns it off. Right, let's start again. Right, okay. So, I want the engine to the back wheels. Like that. And can I have it to these as well? Max connections. But then, I want that to there, right? And then to the wheels. Does that, does that need to be connected to the engine? I think it did, right? Yes, right. Now I need to set the rotation. So right. <laughs> so what I'd done originally was I'd connected the engine to the front um, bearings. I wanted it connected to the back, so I want it rear wheel drive because you can only have two drive connections by the look of it. And then um, you need to connect the um, the steering seat, the steering seat, <laughs> the driver's seat. To the steering bearings, which are these ones on the front? Oh, actually, that's not going to work, is it? So I need to put them. I need to do that to there. Okay, right. So I need to go to the bearings to turn the bearings. Okay, so the the uh, driver's seat's now turning the bearings. The engine's driving these two back bearings to drive the wheels. And the engine connects the driver's seat. I imagine to connect everything together, give it all power. Right? It must be something like that. I think um, and that looks like it's ready but we've got to change the rotation of the bearings now which I don't know so when you go up to them can I do that now it's away or do I need the connection tool out oh there we go uh, right mouse button change rotation I guess that don't matter right it's these that matter yeah I want them to go that way I think <laughs> well moment of truth I guess let me pick these up pick this up okay use okay they're turning the wrong way so there's one thing we need to change and it's not starting mm, do I need gas in it oh, let's change them before I forget There we go, that's them done. Um, engine power. Oh, there we go, fuel. Right, that's cool though. So now will it start? Hey, <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> oh my god, okay, I'm definitely going to wait for morning to check this out, guys. Right, okay. Let's uh, try it out then. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Look at him bouncing around, oh my god. These wheels are atrocious. I don't know what's worse, this or running. Right, let me try something. Oh god damn it, carried on going. Let's just go max power, what happens now? Well, we're moving. Look <laughs> at the state of it. Oh, I tell you what, is it too front heavy? It's lifting the back up? Looks like it, doesn't it? Um, okay, let's try something. Let's try front wheel drive.
Oh, it does not like that. Okay. Oh, hang on. Did that reset the rotation? I think it did, actually. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh my god, look at the state of it. Ooh, a new box just spawned. Let's get this, see what's in it. If we get some more wheels, I might add some more wheels in the back. Okay, cool. I think if you wait for him to swing and then jump away. Now let's grab this and uh, put it in the back. Maybe this will weigh it down a bit. Cool. Let's get this dude. Come on. Oh, he got me. Oh, he got me again. Oh, he got me again. God damn it, it's not working. Okay, my theory was wrong. And uh, now I'm paying for it. Oh, boy. Maybe wait from swinging. No, god damn it! Ah, oh, he got me. No, I oh, went for respawning. Nice. You'll have to uh, let me know in the comments below if there's a um, you know a little method for killing them things efficiently. I was thinking if I was waiting for him to swing and like dodging out of the way, I'd get out of range, but I don't. Oh, I just remembered something. So while I was waiting for daytime, I tried to fill up my little water cup. Oh, my little cup. You can't do it. Um, it it's just like a decoration, if anything. You just place it down. I got him that time without getting hit. But, um, yeah, so there was that. And also, I plop that down there. Got my little rubber ducky on there. Oh, yeah, my little mascot. Sweet. Let's get this before I forget it. Anyway, the whole point of getting this, obviously, is because uh, you get it at the start. Uh, but also because I want to see where this road goes, and I didn't want to go without a vehicle. But seemingly, <laughs> I think it might be quicker to run, or at least at this point. That thing's not giving up. That thing's actually keeping up with me. God damn, that is shocking. Well, what's this? What is this? It's a shop. He followed me the entire way. Wow. Are these all shops? Two for free. <gasps> Shakes. Oh, I can collect all this wood. Sale. Can I collect anything here? What have I just picked up? Old fruit stand. I don't want that. Ooh, cool little light. Alright. Oh, wait. Can I take this? Oh! Oh, and the others. Okay, that's cool. Got a milkshake stand thingy. <laughs> Hard work pays off. Can I take that? I can take the poster. Yes. Got some decorations already. Ooh, till money. I know I can pick it up though. I can also pick up all these blocks. I'm not going to, but if um, I'm nearby here when we find the garage, I'm probably going to come back. Ooh, does this bed count as a respawn thing here? Might take that just in case. Can I put lights on here? Got just some white ones, or are they all the same? I mean, they look terrible. That looks kind of cool though, sort of. There we go, oh yeah, look at that. Still looks weird with just one light on the front. Oh, I can lay these in there as well. Alright, cool. How much do these light things up at night? Okay, that's cool. can actually see a fair bit now. Oh yeah. Oh, God damn it, this thing is <laughs> impossible to drive. I can't turn at all now. What's going on? Oh, there we go. 
Well, we've got some sort of contraption. Anyway, that's the main thing. I'm going to have to keep exploring, heading this way, see if I can find the garage. And um, stop here because there's a build now I'm going to go and check out in a minute, see if there's any parts in it. I'd love some better wheels to see if that's the problem. If you know down below, leave a comment and let me know um, how I could make the traction better. And um, if I see it before I find any better upgrades or figure out for myself, then I will definitely be <laughs> taking any advice. So, yeah, let me know down below. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed it. There's how you at least get some form of a vehicle started in the start of the game. I'm pretty happy how that turned out. It looks a bit different. It's cool. Um, yeah, it just doesn't handle very well right now, but we'll fix it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.